I am going to increase my breast size without any exercise or without surgery. But I'm only going to be listening to an audio. Can you believe that? Good morning, everybody, or good evening, or good night, or whatever time you're watching this video. I am back with another subliminal video. You guys requested me to do this video and I am going to do this. This will probably be my last subliminal video until you guys request me for another one. Now these two are the other subliminals that I have already done on my channel. If you want to check that out, you, you can visit the link in my description. Now I love listening to subliminals, but I also love listening to audiobooks about spirituality, about success, about self-development. And my favorite place to listen to audiobooks is Audible. Now, what is Audible? Now, Audible is the leading provider of spoken words entertainment all in one place. You don't want to read a book? Head to Audible. At Audible, you can find the largest selection of audiobooks ranging from bestsellers, new releases, celebrity memoirs, and binge-worthy podcasts. And also, the new Plus catalog makes Audible membership much more valuable. And some of my favorite features in the Audible's Plus catalog are select audiobooks, podcasts, audio originals, guide and fitness and meditation programs and also sleep trackers for better sleep and so much more. And the best part is Audible members get one free audiobook every month and full access to Plus catalog. Who doesn't love free things? And also there's a free 30 day trial. All you have to do is visit audible.com slash Nimesha or text Nimesha to 500, 500. Also, this video is sponsored by Audible. I really want to thank them for sponsoring this video. And trust me guys, even though this is a sponsored video, I have been with them for almost six months now. This one over here, The 5 AM Club by Robin Sharma and Think Like a Monk by Jay Shetty, which is also narrated by Jay Shetty. So I am going to be listening to a subliminal for seven days straight. Now, what is a subliminal? Now, although I've already explained this multiple times, I'm going to do it again. Basically, subliminals are audios that have hidden messages that targets and reaches the subconscious mind, basically manifesting. Now, subliminals are another technique of manifestation and law of attraction. Just like we have visualizing, scripting, 555 method, 333 method, so anyways, this is how my breasts look right now. Let's measure it real quick. So it is at 83 centimeters. Now to measure the after results, I am going to be wearing the exact same clothes. So the results are much more accurate. So anyways, let's get started with the video. But first, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the bell button to get notified whenever I post. And yeah, let's get started. So it is day one. And I got my subliminal here ready with me right now. I'm just gonna plug in my earphones. Now you do have to listen to subliminals with earphones on so you can hear much better and much more clearly. And also throughout this video, I will be answering any questions that you guys have. So anyways, keep watching and I'm gonna get started. Okay, so I am done listening to the subliminal. I remember in my first subliminal video, after listening to it for the first time, I had headaches and I had this weird feeling. But this time and the last time I did it, which is from the same person, by the way, I did not have that. So that's a good thing. Okay, so it is day two. So the question for today is, do subliminals actually work? So here's the thing, subliminals are just like law of attraction. Subliminals are known to work 40 to 50%. There's no guarantee that it will work, but it does work for some people. 40 to 50% is the number. That means 50 to 60% it does not. You could take your chances. So now this depends on a lot of things. For example, limiting beliefs, if you're putting in the work and if the subliminal that you're listening to is really a subliminal. So you need to do your research before actually listening to a subliminal. But yes, subliminals are known to work 40 to 50%. So anyways, I got my subliminal ready. I am going to listen to it. And the question for today is, are subliminals safe? Now, this is actually something I wanted to talk about. The main reason a lot of people in the subliminal community get very toxic and try to gatekeep 
subliminals in the first place is because negativity could be spread in the subliminal community toxicity negativity all of those things and some people could actually make bad subliminals for example which could cause you depression anxiety and just negative things so that's why it's very important to do your research before actually starting subliminals go through the comments go through the results and make sure that this person is actually authentic and this person is not a toxic person because there have been a lot of other toxic people who are in the community making subliminals that are actually bad for people and be careful with what subliminals you actually listen to now don't ask me which sub makers are good and which are safe sometimes you gotta do your own homework so whatever you choose to listen to do a little research do your homework and make sure it's safe because there are bad people in this world honestly i never understand like why would people do that like why do you want to turn such a good thing into a bad thing now, now those are the type of people that the members in the subliminal community hate and that's the main reason that they want to gatekeep it but unfortunately you cannot gatekeep things like this it is a part of law of attraction i get so many hate comments every time i make a subliminal video but that's not gonna stop me because my opinions and my perspective is different so yeah so anyways i got my audio over here now the question for today is how do subliminals actually work so basically subliminals are known to access the subconscious mind because we can't do that we cannot access our subconscious mind but subliminals can do that basically that's how it works and i'm very bad at explaining so this is the only way that i can actually explain it these subliminals have messages like frequencies that our naked ear cannot hear but our subconscious mind can actually catch on it and it would actually access our subconscious mind and do the work for us so anyways i got my subliminal ready let's get started i swear to god my earphones are messier than my life clear representation of my life struggles and i am done for the day also a very common question that i get is how long do i listen to the subliminal well this subliminal is 2 minutes and 17 seconds so basically you listen for 2 minutes and 17 seconds and you listen to it once a day if you want you can listen to it twice a day but i'm listening to it just once a day all right so it is day five and the question for today is how do you make subliminals work my only answer for this is believe in it now a lot of people use subliminals and say that oh it doesn't work and stuff like that one maybe it's not meant for you two you're not actually believing in it if you have limiting beliefs such as oh it might not work does it even work if you're doing subliminal only to see if it works or not and not actually wanting it then yeah it's not gonna work the universe is not a game to play anyways i am ready for day five that's 10 i'm ready for day five everybody so finally it's the result day let's measure so once again like i said i am wearing the exact same top so we could get an accurate result i actually bit my tongue and it's really hard for me to talk now but let's do this no freaking way it is at 87 centimeters so i started off with this and now i am this so as you can see, there is a difference. So all I can say is, as per the measurements, my breast size has definitely grown, but I don't see any physical changes to be really honest, except the fact that it's a little perkier. Then again, I'm not 100% sure if it's just the way I'm seeing it or if it's actually true, because sometimes when we wanna see results, we see results. So yeah, that means this subliminal actually worked and I'm so happy about it. But here's one thing, I am not going to continue doing this because I'm not necessarily looking forward to growing my breast size. I'm happy with what I have. If you want to do it, go ahead and do it. And to make it more effective, hit the gym, lift up some dumbbells, eat the right foods, and you will see a difference. And honestly, whenever it comes to body changing subliminals, I would always recommend hitting the gym instead of actually listening to subliminals. You could use subliminals for things like healing, positivity, and stuff like that. 
but I feel like in order to change physical appearance it might be better if you actually hit the gym so that's about it for this video if you guys would like for me to do other subliminal videos leave a comment down below what you would like for me to try out next or other video ideas that you would like for me to do whether it's skincare fitness vlogs whatever it is and once again I want to thank audible for sponsoring this video and that's it for this video and I will see you guys in my next video bye bye